Now to the latest facts surrounding the coronavirus. Right now, stay-at-home orders are in effect for both Orange and Osceola counties. The rules started at 11 o'clock last night, and they will last for at least the next two weeks. Ezzy Castro is live in Orlando for us, and as the officials say, this is all about keeping people safe. Well, Justin, leaders in both counties say this is all about slowing the spread of the virus because the number of cases keep going up. They are hoping people will stay at home and avoid hanging out with others. All of these efforts are meant to keep our residents uh, at home and stop the spread of the highly contagious uh, virus that we're dealing with. Leaders in Orange and Osceola counties again urging residents yesterday to follow the new stay at home order now in effect. Non essential businesses are now closed and people can travel unless they have to. But many places will stay open, like grocery stores and gas stations. This has been much like a roller coaster ride uh, for many of the people in our community, uh, and it's not over yet. Already, businesses in Central Florida have felt the impact from the shutdowns within the last several weeks. Now more businesses will have to keep their doors shut until at least April 9th. It's everybody. It's not just me. It's not just split ends. It's not just people I know. It's everybody. And I just want it to be done so everybody can back to their natural their everyday life. Violators could face a fine or even arrest, but the sheriffs in both counties are hoping that won't be the case and that residents will follow the rules. And keep in mind, Orange County still remains under a curfew from 11 p.m. to 5 a.m. Now, other counties that we spoke to, like Seminole, say they will not be putting a stay-at-home uh, order for now. Still, they are, uh, again, without a stay-at-home order. Now, if you want to learn what businesses will stay open, which ones will be closed, again, we have that on ClickOrlando.com. Live in downtown Orlando, Ezzy Castro getting results news set. All right, Ezzy, thank you. While Marion County doesn't have a stay-at-home order either, commissioners have mandated some more emergency closures. As of 7 o'clock last night, all internet cafes, hookah lounges, bowling alleys, and movie theaters are closed. That also includes places that cater to senior citizens like bingo halls and horse tracks. The order will stay in effect for 60 days. All these closures and stay-at-home orders are designed to try and slow the spread of coronavirus as confirmed cases continue to increase. And nationwide, the total now stands at over 85,000. That surpassed China yesterday for the most cases in the world. Here in Florida, our confirmed case count went up by over 500 since this time yesterday to more than 2,300 now. The majority are in Broward, Miami-Dade, and Palm Beach counties. Orange County has the highest number of cases in Central Florida with 118. And the main driver of those higher numbers is more testing. Hundreds more people are expected to be tested today at Orange County's drive through site at the convention center. 265 people were screened at that site just yesterday, with 250 actually getting the test. The site remains only for health care workers, first responders, and those who are 65 years or older and have symptoms of coronavirus. If you are at least 65, you must have a fever of 99.6 or higher and have respiratory problems. In addition to that testing site, it appears Orange County doctors will begin making their own test kits in order to process patients faster. Dr. Raul Pino, the administrator at the Orange County's Department of Health, made that announcement yesterday. We have acquired uh, sufficient uh, ingredients to make our own test kits, collection kits. So tomorrow we will be opening a little shop within the health department to start making test kits. We will continue to acquire uh, those uh, products. Dr. Pino says the health department has enough ingredients to make about 200 kits tomorrow and another 200 as soon as next week.